So Keir Starmer has been deemed a hypocrite over pictures of him drinking with colleagues in Durham last May, when indoor mixing between households was banned except for work. The Labour leader was seen through a window of a building standing close to others with a beer in hand. He staunchly denies any wrongdoing. The picture of me was in a constituency off, office up in the northeast. It was, I think, three or four days before the May election, so we're really busy. I was my, with my team going across the country from place to place. We we're in the office, working in the office, um, and we stopped for a takeaway, and then we carried on working. And that is the long and the short of it. There was no breach of the rules. Um, there was no party. With both the Tories and now Labour under fire for seemingly breaking lockdown rules, it begs the question, have lockdown rules been too harsh? Jacob Rees-Mogg told MPs last Thursday a future inquiry about COVID should look at whether regulations were too hard on the British public, highlighting Brits who have suffered socially distanced funerals and couldn't visit lonely high-risk relatives. But I think everybody understands, on all sides of the House, that people were obeying the rules and that these rules were very hard for people to obey. Uh, I, I received a message last night from a friend of mine uh, who was unable to go to the funeral of his two-year-old granddaughter. Now, one cannot hear these stories without grieving for people who suffered. And this was something, decisions that were taken at the beginning of the pandemic, that affected people up and down the country, and they were very hard. And we must consider, as this goes to an inquiry, and we look into what happened with COVID, whether all those regulations were proportionate, or whether it was too hard on people. Whether it was too hard on people. Valerie Brown, The Sun.